what is up humanoid nation it's another it's time for another video from these karens and court videos i love these court videos and also karen sovereign citizens prodigers oh, all that stuff is just so juicy to watch this voodoo voodoo god damn this youtube channel is by elusive when a karen goes to prison we know how karens act let's see how they act like how they are when they're going to prison and how they piss off the judge, hopefully. Don't piss off the judge, folks. Anyways, let's do this. We all know Karens love to do some crazy things, but what happens after? In today's video, we take a look at what they did and where they are now. But before we get into the video, if you want to be in the video, please submit your clips in the description below. All right, back to the video. Now this Soho Karen- In the video as in going to court video, like- or fighting other people, I don't know. Okay. He uses her iPhone, then decides to accuse a black teenage male of stealing it, and things just got crazy. Me, no, you don't have no, to explain no, nothing no, to her. Take the case off, that's fine. Literally, get, get it back, please. Are you kidding me? You feel like there's only one one iPhone made in the world? No, okay, then show me the show No, me you get to get a life. Over yeah, there, no, what phone you lost around? Go, you better go no, use, no, find, find my iPhone. Go yeah, do that. Find my I don't think she's a Karen, she's just racist. She sees a black guy, so who was like, hey, he stole my phone. Oh, how is that a Karen? I'm just wondering, because, can't, yeah, I don't know. My iPhone is off. Okay, off now, right? We have, you, what, you, you, see, you see two people? No, I'm not letting him walk away with my phone! Please, 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 well, she left it behind in the Uber on the way to the shops, and instead of finding her iPhone, using an app or by herself, she found four new felony charges instead. Here's a clip straight from the courtroom. Apparently a warrant from the state of New York alleging a felony violation for attempted robbery in the third degree. Your Honor, why are you wearing a mask if you're the only one in the court? I'm assuming there's... Okay. Doing Zoom... Okay, I mean, this is a stupid question. Is there other people during the Zoom court, but he's the only one inside? I just gotta ask, because, like, they're in their office, their sole office and all of them, and I just find it kind of weird. Yeah, but whatever. Child, attempted grand larceny in the fourth degree, and attempted assault in the third degree. Ten However, years! Holy shit! Thing, and within the next four months, the 22-year-old landed herself a new offense and was charged with a DUI, resisting arrest, and obstructing a police officer. Eventually, they all pulled into a gas station, and once again, she appeared completely out of control. With her mother trying to stop the situation, cops say they were eventually able to get a reading on her blood alcohol level. 0.14. Almost Good lord, lady! Women. This is Soho Karen's second arrest, and she was on probation. Getting arrested and charged with DUI could be enough for her to do jail time. There's also a pending case where she was charged with being drunk in public in Beverly Hills. Hey, this lady, okay, she's crazy. Like, come back, is she? Damn, dude. Racist, Karen, and then drunk. Okay. After all the footage coming out about Soho Karen, I believe we are starting to see a clearer picture of who she is. Moving on now, this central. Oh, okay, I seen this one. Oh, this one kind of pissed me off. Was like, yeah, also. Uh, so like, yeah, there's a black guy right here. I remember this video. He treats her dog like shit, too. Fuck. Park Start. Karen claimed she exhausted all options before she called 911 on a black bird watcher after he asked her to put her dog on a leash. Can you please stop? Sir, I'm asking you to stop. Please don't come close to me. Sir, I'm asking you to stop recording me. Please, please don't stop. come close to me. Please okay, now this is a Karen. Um, the other video, you said the guy stole a phone. I'm just saying she's racist. This one, she's an all, all, absolute Karen. Cause like, like turned up. I was like, he, it's a black guy watching birds. Was it, Call the cops! Please don't come close to me. She was then seen taking out her cell phone and telling 911 dispatchers that the man was recording her and threatening to harm both her and her dog. Please, please call the cops. Please call. The cops. I'm, I'm I'm just wondering how they don't realize shit they say and is recorded, and he's also recording her. Karen's don't think, I swear to God. It's like, I'm going to lie to the 911 dispatcher. I'm going to tell them there's an African-American man threatening my life. Please. African-American man. Uh, it's like that scary movie joke back in the day. It was, in the movie it's funny, but in real life it's not. It's like, the black man in my house, get the cops, they come in right away. Like, real life, uh, yeah, that's something different. Tell them whatever you like. Excuse me? 
You're choking the dog, madam. Let go of your dog. You're like Although that wasn't from the only neck. phone call she made that day. Reports say that straight after the recording, she made a second call claiming she was assaulted. It turns out you shouldn't make any false allegations because she has since lost her job and her dog, but now also faces up to one year jail time, but might escape attending lost an dog, educational good. program in hopes to educate her about what she did. For the next Karen, she'll definitely be attending an educational program in the future after she went on several anti-Asian rants. Respect. Respect. Respect people. Respect. Lady, I don't understand your language. And not, you know what? I am not a racist person. You just, you just made a. Wait, when they say I'm not a racist person, you're a racist person. I'm not racist, but. You know what? Woman. You need to go home. I am from here. Look it. Go home. I am here from here. Go. Home. I don't care about your Facebook or your video. Oh, okay. You're Do you know how many people right can't now? stand you being oh, here? Oh, great. You play games. We don't play games. Oh, what? Go back to whatever country you belong in okay you racist this is not your place this is not your home we do not want you here Ooh. you put that on facebook i hope you do but it gets worse just wait i was up at the lamo mall just using the restroom uh the cleaning lady comes into the restroom clean up the stalls her door was unlatched the cleaning lady opened the door and that crazy lady starts yelling ranting at the cleaning lady saying are you effing blind you should get fired b and then obviously the cleaning lady is apologizing but she still keeps on spewing these crazy things to her and we lock eyes me and the cleaning lady and then that's when i say you need to stop it you're being rude and that's when she comes out and physically pushes me to the ground and then she points down at me and says you better not get the f up or else that's right. Hold on. Was she still shitting when she came up at you and threw you to the ground? Did she have her pants down? She was in a stall. The cleaning lady came in. So she was mid shit, right? Did she pull up her pants before she pushed it over? I just want to know. I need answers. Come on, man. She allegedly assaulted a woman in a mall. She agreed to plead no contest to a misdemeanor charge in exchange for a sentence of 47 days behind bars plus three years probation with anger management classes. She was also ordered to stay at least 100 meters away from the victim and the mall. Where Don't forget to wipe. If you did, we need answers. Where the attack happened. Now, how's this for a joke? This Karen told a Starbucks worker the next time he would see her, she will have the police and a medical certificate after being refused services for not wearing a mask. Okay, uh... A chocolate and a birthday. All right, one birthday, one chocolate, and what else was it? A water. All right, can I get you anything else today? No, thank you. Perfect, I will see you at the window in your photo, so don't forget to get it. The Karen later returned to the store without the police but a piece of paper, holding it like a shield and demanding service. Can you do a paper? I don't. I have a medical exemption. Hold on. You're outside. Oh, yeah, you do need a face mask outside. Never mind. Yeah, because they're inside. They don't want to catch your shit. Medical exemption. Nah, I'm not going to get it. That We're going to go down. A That's going to lead somewhere else. Wow, they just shut the doors. They won't even serve me. Are you recording? I am. You're live. Because I'm sick of being discriminated against and I don't have a mask. I have a mask and a, a medical exemption. I have a mask and a medical exemption. The worker alerts the manager and she has refused service once again but claims she will sue them. You guys are going to be sued. I'm suing you. I want your names. Regina, who else is on staff right now? Regina, this is discrimination. Are you aware of California 51A, set civil section codes 51A? It says you, we have the right to to, eat, to shop anywhere we want, regardless of age, sex. And the stores have the right to refuse service to anybody. That's their policy. You don't agree with their store policy? Go somewhere else. Saying they don't want to offer you service? It's on them. 
sexual orientation, race. This Karen didn't win, and when she found out that someone made the Starbucks worker a GoFundMe, which received well over $100,000, she claimed she was suing for half. He's, I'm gonna sue him for What kind of asshole are you? Seriously, ultimate Karen mode. Or half of it. She says the lawyers she's spoken to about taking her case are expensive and she can't afford one yet, so she started her own GoFundMe to raise money for herself. When asked if she has any apology or message to the public. Uh, no, absolutely not. I. But the judge wasn't having any of it. The court heard a federal judge threw out her complaint and told her to move on. Nice. That's how it should be done, judge. Great job, judge. He has this attitude on her. He's like, no, I'm not going to apologize. I got this medical exemption card. Medical exemption card. Can't wear a mask for five minutes outside. Really? You can take it off in your car, but when you get there, you have to put it on. Because other people are afraid. You know, like I said, I'm not going to get into this. And it's too much. It's going to start an argument. <laughs> but fuck. I don't know what else to say about that. Really don't. By the way. Uh, so was that, stop being Karens, Karen. Just stop being Karens. Anyway, that's it for now. Human Nation, Humanoid Freak Out. Bye. Pasito a pasito, suave, suavecito, nos vamos pegando.